He has the ability after last year, you know, he showed kind of what he can do and of course he's a quality person all the way around, the kind of person that uh, uh, he has a lot of friends, he's quiet, he's self-confident, he goes about his business, he always has a great smile on his face, he always has fun, he posts up for every ball game, uh, you, never, you never have to wonder how he's feeling or what's going on because he loves the game. Last year from the beginning of the season to the end of the season, I didn't see a change at all in Desmond, you know, and, and he had some success last year. He's kind of, he's one of those guys that carries a, carries a big stick with him, you know, he's kind of pretty humble and uh, obviously comes from, from his uh, parents. Nice. Stay right there, that a boy. I try to let my play speak for itself, so um, I don't really have to say too much. I just try to play hard and, and help my team win. Talk is, 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 is cheap, you know. Like I say, um, if you ain't doing nothing on the field, then you ain't too much to talk about, so I, I try and do everything on the field. He, he is pretty quiet. Um, but he plays extremely hard and it doesn't impact him anyway on the field. Desmond continues to get better and the, and the biggest compliment I can give him is that his instincts for the game are top notch. And so you see a lot of people who come in and have skills and ability uh, that just don't quite have a feel for the game and uh, I think it's innate and it's something that you know, he really came with and our guys have done a great job of refining. Desmond batted 315 and stole an organizational high 45 bases in 2007 for the Catfish, twice being named Rays Minor League Player of the Month. Drafted by Tampa Bay in the 10th round of the 2006 June draft, Jennings was named the best athlete and the number six prospect in the organization by Baseball America. Still need to work on everything. I rely on my speed a lot more than, than a, lot of, a lot of other things. The speed's always going to be an asset for him because guys that can run are always going to get those extra base hits that kind of keep things going. Uh, and he will learn to hit for some power. He was hitting for power last year uh, towards the end of the season where he was picking a pitch. It was about midway where all of a sudden he got into a hitter's count and they were throwing him some fastballs and he was really gearing up and looking for him. I think once he starts growing into a, uh, his body and he gets a little more strength, it'll come to him because he's got a very nice swing. So he got room to improve hitting, um, arm strength. Um, getting reads on balls in the outfield. In mid-June, Desmond had the opportunity to play alongside Rocco Baldelli, who spent part of his rehab assignment with Vero Beach. And Rocco couldn't help but notice some similarities between himself and Desmond. To be able to sit back and, you know, be a little older now and watch a young guy come up with that same type of, uh, you know, approach is, it's, it's nice. I mean, if, I guess I could relate to him in the way that he handles himself and, uh, you know, maybe that's one reason he might want to relate to me. They yeah, talk to Rocco. Um, we talk every game on the bench. Just like, um, talk about the pitches he gets, pitch location, and, and you know, stuff like that. I think he plays with a, with a, a controlled enthusiasm. Um, he, uh, he doesn't go out of control anywhere, swinging the bat in the outfield. He, he knows what he's doing, and I think, uh, you know, in time, he's going to play in the big leagues, and he's probably going to play there a long time. He's a great athlete. I'm going day by day, you know. I'm trying to do the best I can today and tomorrow and have it play out. I expect him to continue to get better and better, just kind of like a fine wine. <laughs>